yeah hello everyone good day welcome to today's tutorial my name is Azan Adela it's been a long time I <laughs> use my voice so I'm really happy to use it today so I just feel like doing something there's something trending and that is Vema's song calm down featuring Selena Gomez if you know the song if you go to YouTube right now it's like doing mad like crazy everywhere like let me just show you so you see what I'm saying so just type Rema featuring Selena Gomez that is it so this is just the three days 9.3 million that's crazy like mad <laughs> so I just want to do a cover a freestyle cover I've not done it before I just go went online to get some pictures of the boat and I just want to create something of the top like I don't know what I'm creating right now but unless I forget this is my youtube channel please do subscribe and like my video share it with your friends and make this channel go worldwide please I appreciate you I drop videos daily as I have the strength to do so with your subscriptions and views I'll be able to do more and better for you guys so let's just jump straight to it So these are the two pictures I have. One, this for Rema, and this for Selena Gomez. So I will work on the Rema zone first. So I'll just convert it, this to a smart object. Like I told you before, smart object are if you don't convert your stuff to smart object, you won't. You will be losing the quality of your file, of your image. When by the time you start transforming and reducing, making it big, bringing it down, the size quality, the quality of the image will reduce it to get blurry stuff like that. So you need to convert it to a smart object. That's why you always see me come here, convert to smart objects. And why I restarize later is maybe I want to. There are some certain things you can't do, which when your when your file is on a smart object, you can't brush it. You see, this is a sign that you can't do anything on it. You can't use your healing brush too. So there's so many things you can't do on it if it's like that. So we just have to do that. So that's why you see me most of the time. I just you see me I restarize, I convert to smart object. There's no big deal about that. That is why. And for my zooming in and zooming out, there's no magic there. I just love zooming out and zooming in. So don't think there's anything special about it. So we we'll just jump straight to it. I'll just use my what am I using? Yeah, I'll use my Celeste subject, the fastest tool to remove any background from Photoshop. Faster than like faster than the speed of light if you have a good system that's speed up things. But this mine is not that good as I taking this much time. If you have a system that just read things once, I tell you within two seconds it's gone. So this is it's selected everything perfectly for us. So we are just going to mask it their mask yeah automatically so don't worry about the air that is cut off don't worry about that i may not be needing that part if you're wondering what what am i trying to create don't worry i'm just getting some inspiration on what i want to do probably so this is us we just come to well i say i want to like i want to retouch the boat images together so i just want to remove the boat the backgrounds and i'll group them I'll put them in a group and do the retouching together but later I know because of the color difference and the image qualities varies I'll need to do some individual retouch on each image again but firstly I'll do a general one on them and see how it comes out so let's just jump straight into removing this background select and subject our image has more quality than Amazon so we we'll just wait for this to happen. So please always like my videos, always drop your comments in the comment section. Let's just there ask me any question and anything you need, just drop it down at the comment section and you get it. I promise you. So this did a good work, but there are some places you can see some places are not quite okay. So we we'll just use our quick selection brush. I say brush tool. I will just select this part so that sorry I need to hold my alt and just select this remove mine from my alt to clean this part yes and 
hold my alt again to add this to this part so i'll remove this place remove man from the alt the alt is for minus and why the why if you click without the alt is plus so that is why i'm holding and releasing the alt so i hold my alt to minus this part so okay it filled up this place again i will release my alt to bring it back so sometimes it can get crazy like this sorry i'm not supposed to even bring that place right this is where i'm supposed to come yeah something like so so you get crazy sometimes like this so don't just worry so something like that should be okay for that so i'll do this part also so holding my heart and doing this we'll go Don't make me fall fast forward this place. <laughs> so it's really doing mesh. Oh gosh. Sorry. So my heart, yeah. So I'll just leave this like this, please. I don't <laughs> okay. This part hold my heart again, yeah. So I guess I'm good to okay. I uh, uh, yes, it's crying that I should do that. Okay, I'll just zoom in and get that out of the way. Okay, I think I'm good to go. So I'll just max it out. Yeah, please go to my comment section and tell me which tutorial you want me to do. And trust me, I'm going to do it. So we are done with that so i'll just try to reduce the size of the image probably like this so the first thing i want to think is who is the owner of the song the song is owned by rema so whatsoever i'm doing he must be at the forefront of this so let her be at the back and let's increase this probably So once it's like this, what I want to do is, okay, should I do it now? Okay, let's do now. Let's just zoom everything up, like up, up to this point. To this point, something like this should do. So I'll zoom is, I'll zoom this guy. Because I want that head to be off, like off, like totally off. But in making the head off, I'm covering the ladies. Too bad, too bad. So, what I'm going to do is that it doesn't want to heal. So, what I'll do is this I'll just let me convert because now I want to do something. I can't do it while it's on what they call it smart objects. So I, I need to rasterize it then. Come here. I need to fill this place with uh, so I'll just look for part of his air that looks like what that place should look like so I felt this should do this part so I'll just cut this portion out if I cut it out like this to come with the background so I need to just convert this to a smart object so that this this cutting ratio yeah like so so I'll just control J now so I've duplicated that part that I cut. If you want to know how to do this, just watch my beginner's tutorial. It's on the channel. Just go there. You see, you see the video among the videos I have there too. So I don't really know. Maybe this how is we really, looks like, but she pardon me. <laughs> I think I don't want to go and check. Please, this is just for tutorial purposes, please. Very much you forgive me if this is not how it looks like, but. I guess it's good like this. It should, be, it should be pretty cool like this. So I will mesh the both together. I guess no, not yet. I'll create a layer mask, and I will just brush the edges off so that it looks so that it looks blended. Change my color to black. So I'll just blend it like that. So something like this looking good so after that now i can now say okay let me just blend 
let me merge them together select the both and cover smart variable it merge them together so i'll add the layer marks again these places are sharp i want to just sorry i need to add address to my brush like 71 sorry my mouse is misbehaving yeah so i'll just clean over this portion so that it will be to look cut out so something like this should look nice yeah Rema, forgive me if this is not how you look like <laughs> please <laughs> you are a Rema fan don't be too mad at me i'm just a graphic designer so so now we have the image the head properly somehow fixed so i can reduce him i can also reduce the lady so i just want something like so so the issue i'm having now there are bend rema z is bent which i don't want i want it stretched so i'll just rotate like this i want it to be looking straight to me on that bending of head something so the lady is looking straight both are looking straight now so i'm not going to enlarge it like this enlarge it like this so this is good to go for me i don't know about you but for me this is good to go so once i'm done with that should i merge this to image i want to do that yes i need to do that let me just let me see myself distressed so i've merged them but the good thing about this is i've merged them but i can still split that is one thing about convert to smart object i can double click later to resh reshape them or shift them move them using the smart object that is the advantage of smart and that's what they use for mock-up because when this is what they use for mock-up and they say click this place so when you click it you see the edited version where you can adjust anything and click control save and it comes back and reflects in your original document so that is just by the way <laughs> for me today how to use mockup properly the best practice for mockup usage just drop it right in the comment section and i'll do a video on it so what next so after doing this i need to do my normal retouching to pass using my to pass lab if you need a topaz lab, just write, send the writers in the comment section. Tell me that I need the topaz lab plugin. I need new collection. I need any of the plugins you are seeing here. Just message me and I will give you a link to it. So, this, what should I use? What should I use? Should I go to new collection? Let me see new collection. Let me go to HDR effect. Let me see what this gives me. So probably I'm going to use this, do this as a black and white image. I'm going to turn this to a black and white image because of the idea I'm getting in my head. I don't really know what I want to do, but I'm getting some rough sketches in my brain right now. So let's just walk through this. It may be a long video, but it's what it. You learn a lot from it, so trust me. I wish I can play the song underneath, but they are going to flag me off for that. So. Just pardon me, I can't I can't play that. Why is stuff showing their pictures? The background. I don't know. That's none of my business. So we'll just look for a cool image to use. Wow. Sound like something like this is not bad. I'm sounding somehow though. <laughs> I mean something like this is not bad so let's just look for more so new collection is a good collection for your image retouching also so you could see different effects they are just they are just pretty pretty cool so i'll just go back like i don't need this i'll go to another one from the new collection this stuff so let me try is this silver fx pro i wish it is like this the black and white part here yeah, silver yeah, it should if 
you love the way I talk in my video and you want me to continue talking, speaking, using my voice, please let me know in the comment section. If you want me to just play music over it, let me know too. So I know the best practice to adopt. So I'll just look for a good black and white feel. You see, that's the beauty of African skin. It brings out this, you understand, uh, this kind of like silver kind of gradient feel. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm not saying white colors are not good, but I just love the fact that it makes the design pops out, it gives it that popping. Maybe I'm going to pop the both skin also at the long run, so I'll make them pop a little bit. So I'm just looking for what works best for this picture. Yeah, I'm trying to consider both images and see which which is best. So I'm still looking for sorry, this is how I take time in designing. Don't don't mind me. I don't, I don't get easily. So I'm thinking of since I'm doing something dark, let me uh I just give you an example. I'm doing something dark, something really dark. So let me go for this. So I'm saving. So so this is somehow it's pretty cool, not really pretty cool. Yeah. So I'll go to Topaz Lab and just make this stuff pop a little bit more. All right, it's already popping out. Right? I just want something little, a little bit of that pop again. So, so some nigga will be like, "I ah, is going to smudge now." No, I'm not going to smudge nothing. <laughs> I'm not going to smudge anything on these pictures. Like, I'm not going. I just want that very. I would like call it something rough and I don't know let me, let me just finish up I'm getting what I'm looking for so I, it's popping out now I'll just do go to my new collection again go to reverser so please don't be scared that I don't have this I don't have that just drop in my, the comment section that I need this plugin I need this plugin and definitely I'll reply to your messages I don't want it to be too much, I don't want to spoil their faces because I'm not planning to smudge, so I'm being careful, like really careful, I don't want to smudge. So something like this, so I'll just I'll now add my sharpen, smart sharpen to even bring more details out, but this is going to be too much, um, let me see, okay. Let me see how it goes. I hope I don't damage the images. <laughs> so, yeah. So for me, this is as far as I can, I can go for now. This is looking more like what I'm picturing in my head. So I'll just add a solid, or let me add the background first. Yeah. Let's just find a background, a rough background. I don't know. What should I use? What should I? The title is calm down. So what are we coming down for? What are we coming down for? Should I use this? Should I use this? It is more like does it really depict anything? So I don't really need something that depict anything. Yeah, I'm just going to. <laughs> oh, should I use this 3D wallpaper? Let me see. So if I'll be asking me, how do you create your backgrounds? How do you get inspiration for creating backgrounds? I don't even know. Like, I, <laughs> I won't even say I know how to create backgrounds. But there are a few tricks I use, few few things I think is very easy for me to create background. Put a background and blow it. Simple. You are good to go. So most of, most of the time, that's what I do. If you know me, if you know my design, I just put stuff like this and just blow it. And that's it. I'm done. I'm not done. Yeah. So I'll just create a solid color now and use red. I love red, yes. 
so i'm not going to post it i'm going to put it above yeah like so and i'll change the blending mode yeah something like this should work yeah which of them please or well, let me go down more something like this should work but i need it to be more dark okay so let me leave it at the back that's for the back so i'll now create another one something like this and i'll now probably let me go to i don't know what i'm doing right now but let me do something let me see the blending option if i can blend it naturally or uh, whichever let me see maybe the blending will work on this okay so I'll roll this i just want that just on that natural uh -huh. this is where i can really control what i'm doing on the i'm just trying so one thing about photoshop i really type will try things out you may you not really know what you are doing but just try that there's no amateur nobody's watching you <laughs> just try that like see i'm just trying things out nobody i don't like like nobody's going to sue you nobody's going to sue you yeah you understand what i'm doing now see i'm trying to blend this color into and that's one good thing about this story you blend stuff into them yourself so you get that feel so but i like to be too much so i'll just leave it probably like this that is if i like this but i don't think i like it so i will create another solid red color don't mind me i just want to do a freestyle so just enjoy the video if you don't want me to do videos like this anymore you just let me know in the comment section <laughs> yeah i won't try this anymore i know some people will say what is it doing You're just wasting my time he's not doing something so for forgive me for that i won't do it anymore if you don't like it so just let me know but if you like this type of videos i just try things out on my own please also let me know so i'll stick to it so I want something like this, but it's looking too dark for my liking. It's looking too light. So maybe like this should work. So once I'm done like this, I'll create a solid color again, black this time. Then I'll just click on the layer max and go to my brush and increase the size. Select black to clean. Set your hardness to soft, please and your opacity to 100 then click something around the center double click and yeah just reduce the opacity a little bit maybe by leave it at 80 please so something like this so we can just come what am i doing now we are, we are just come uh, at least for a start we cannot start writing when we get something that's once i tell people try to get something like try to get your background ready try to get your your image ready then before you can start writing that's how i do but other people have different ways some people start writing before they get things done depending on what you're doing though if i'm doing a church trial, probably i'll start by editing the images and start the write up then probably and i'll end with the background but whichever way <laughs> just do what works for you but now i'm going to write the write up and one thing about me writing a, doing a write-up is i go with the subject first the main thing and the main thing that the first time I want people to see in this design apart from the images i'm not even interested in the image for now because they didn't do any official image of the music so i'm not trying to portray the image these are all the images from different musics and stuff like that so and for different purposes so I'm not really concerned about the image that's why I had to put a color overlay so you, you won't really be distracted by the images so what I want to do now is the subject is going to be the title of the song which is calm I wrote calm Jesus. sorry it should be calm so it's just the calm down Hope I'm correct. So I'll just 
increase the size always you make your title big and bold so I don't know the font I'm going to use yet but let me just I'm sure it's not Monty right I'm not using Monty right I'll use I'm using Monty right in the design but I'm not using it for the title trust me <laughs> because some people like no it's I'm going to use Monty right yeah it's my favorite font but definitely not on this design so maybe i use this blue paint i feel lately i've been using this and i'm kind of cool with it so i love the feel i love that feel so what i want to do again is this down i want to add a, a gradient what they call it a gradient tool so something like fading i'll change this to red i'll select the color from it's not totally red something dark red like this i want to fade this part so i'll just draw my line like this to create this feel yeah draw it again yeah something like that so it's covering my <laughs> artist face so i'm going to just raise it up a little bit raise them up a little bit yeah something like this should do yeah so i'll not change this calm down to white for now take note of my word white for now doesn't mean that that's all right <laughs> so calm down so now what next is the artist name So just write Rema. It's not really like featuring though. I've I've gone to the internet to check. It's not really like featuring. So instead of writing feature, write X. So it's like Rema and so it's like Selly. Is this Selima or Selina? Selina Gomez. Sorry, I'm not. I'm a music person, but I'm not not a just forget about that let's focus on our graphics i don't know anything about music so this should be our title i will love the the text for the title but i can't use i can probably use this too for, for it looks somehow so i'll try to look for a totally different font probably crazy Ivan should do yeah, this should do for me. So if I'm going to keep this up, I'm sure keep this here. So this way you need to think and say what am I going to do? Where am I going to keep this? How am I going to follow the design principles and all that? So you don't just rush and just save your job and say, I'm done, I'm done, I'm done. Now you have to be thinking, what other colors can I use? What other effects can I put? Where should I put this? Where should I put that? So my eyes are not full now, I'm just confused. So what am I going to do now? So I felt calm down. Calm down should be down. It's talking about down, it should be calm down, not calm up. So I'm just joking, but those things can really give you from your title, you get inspiration. So calm down, let's put it down. So name and Selena Gomez, Rema and Selena Gomez, the two names, they are the ones singing the song, so they should be down. They are the ones telling us to calm down, they should be down. Are you me? Okay. Let it come down be up here and their name should be down. They are telling us to come down. They should be the one to do that first. So just joking. So let's say we have them here. So now I'm going to play with my 
What are they called then? I'm trying to look for which one to adjust. If I can't adjust this no more. If I can adjust this, let me see. No, I'm not adjusting this. No, no way. So let me adjust this. Okay, let me see. This is looking, looking good. So, so what I want to do now, I'm just thinking, what I want to do now is probably to, since it's a love song, yeah, something like love, talking to a lady. So, I'm going to I'm going to look for probably flowers and all that to do. So I go to my background. Yeah, I'll look for flowers. So just do things that are related to just uh, so I just look for flowers. I don't have great flowers here, but I'll just do with what I have. I just want something. But anytime I'm taking, should it be red? So let me see if red is going to work. So everything I like I said before, you just try. There's no, there's nobody that is going to beat you here, like. Nobody is going to tell you that what you, you did rubbish, you did this. Nobody is going to tell you all that. Just enjoy yourself, do your work, make sure you love what you do. But don't about being east, you understand? Don't about being east when it comes to you designing. Don't about being east. When it comes to you doing what you love, take your time. It take you the whole day. It doesn't matter. Yeah, I said it. It doesn't matter. So, we'll duplicate. Probably will put it somewhere here. Yeah. Let me see. We we'll now motion do motion blur and see what we have. We we'll set this the angle it's going. So we'll set it like so and we'll put it somewhere. So I'll add motion blur to this also. Yes. So so I add that to it, and once I'm done with that, I just need to. Can probably leave this like this. Too many white stuff. So I'll duplicate. Uh, what should I do? Should I duplicate? Yeah. Let me add one. Let me see if I can work on this. Let me change the blending mode first. That's another secret, guys. I'm sorry, the font has changed. So I'll change the blending mode. I'll switch it. So I see if something good is going to come out. So we'll just work on that. Keep changing. Just take your time. If nothing good is coming out, then I'll show you another thing you do. So what you want to do is tweak the color a little bit, put it somehow yellow. Yeah, this is a normal yellow. So I'll start changing the blending mode again. 
and see what we have. So we we'll keep changing. So we can get something good. So I'll just leave it at this. Probably what I want to do now is now what I did then I want to reverse it because I don't want their face is not distracting me. Yeah. So, don't mind me, I'm coming. So I'm going to delete this, disable it and do something, reduce it. To 60. Yeah. So once that is done, I can now So my only problem now is that I will need to occupy those spaces. I would not have much right up to write, so don't write rubbish because you just need that to write so i'll just do this like so so i'm just bring this swimmer back down i'll bring it up here then i'll do then probably duplicate this so i'll delete this other one i did before so i'll duplicate this ctrl j to do that so i drag it down so we'll draw a normal outlining remove the fill go to double click here Go to layer style effects, layer style, then add your stroke. Going to be white, but that is too much. So do something like this. So maybe one is okay. So we press OK, we'll do another one. Something like this. So now close, close, then select the boat and reduce the opacity and see if it works. But if it doesn't, we cancel. So for me, it doesn't work, so I just delete. So I told you, take your time. <laughs> Good design is not easy to come by. So that I didn't look anything from anywhere. No matter if I look at design before, before starting this, I would have gotten inspiration. So that's why. I advise you guys to always try to do so. So I just increase this and um, change probably change the color to what the called a white color. I guess. So I'll now reduce the fill to something like this. Let's see a black color then. So I increase the fill. So which one is better? So I guess it's the white that is better. So I'll reduce the shade and go back to my white. 
something like this so I'll reduce it to that point So maybe probably increase the countdown itself, the original one, bigger than the length of the names. So once this is done, I would like to get some effect from my by some grunge. I need to put some grunge over there, so I'll just go to grunge. Uh, this is the best grunge I normally use. I love this grunge. So I just increase this and just change, take it above every other stuff and change the blending mode to probably screen. Now do is better lighter color. So I just reduce the opacity because it's too much. Yeah, something like this should do do for me so one thing I'm thinking is okay why not take the pictures and duplicate and the one down rasterize it and take it up to the main calm down and do like this clip mask it when you clip mask it why is it disappearing I don't understand okay it's not on the main cam so I'll take it back up and clip mask it here so once i clip mask it here i will now change the blending mode of the image what i'm doing that is just to give us some feel but the feel is not working if what i'm trying is not working then i might just probably even change the color or adjust the color. So I'm not really changing that color anymore. So I don't want to change the color. So I just want to adjust. So I guess I'll leave it at this. So, even though it's not bringing out <laughs> exactly what I want, but at least it has a different has a different feel from like this to like this so it has something good out there so but i'm saying that it's somehow blur or certain blur so i don't think i like that feel so i think we should keep it simple this way and we'll just delete it but you can try that out but some other designs it comes out perfectly well so what i'm going to do now i still need a few things down here which i'm just going to check on my stuffs and just bring out one or two of them i need flowers good flowers like flowers what i'm seeing here are not good so can somebody show me flowers yeah i need flowers serious flowers like a banquet of flowers like something like this like something like this I need something to sit down here I want something to sit all over here let me remove the background see I know somebody is saying don't use this don't use this but let's just see and see what happens with it I don't even know what I'm doing right now, so <laughs> we can just end this tutorial anyway. So, <laughs> so just do. So don't make it to be the same pattern. Just flip it to the side, reduce it.
So what we'll do now is just merge the converter of them to smart object and do a motion blur. I like motion blur, so uh, if I don't do it, that is not it's just my it's not a must. It's not something. So So we can what can we say now? So we, say we can manage this. So I want to see if I can remove this back and bring it up here. No, I don't want to do that, so I'll go back, go back to this. So probably I will reduce the opacity again to like 50. 50 should kind of do. So, but I want these flowers to be down. I don't want it up here. I want it to be down here. Yeah. So, yeah, like so. So we can just put our adversary stuff and I guess we are done. Is it parental or just adversary? Let me see what that is to save that stuff. The longer I did a cover that requires that. <laughs> so okay, it's parental then. P. Yeah, this is it. There's one a friend of mine gave me, the one people currently use now. I love that, but I can't think I can start looking for that now. So I'll go use this instead. So I'll drag it up here. I'll just place it here. I'll reduce the size. It shouldn't be big, please. So let's just do it like so. Let's do it like that. I want to carry my color BG. So this is what, what I'm doing now. What I'm doing from now is just adjustment. Like doing my um, final adjustment on the stuff. So I just drag it here. So once I drag it up above, so I'll now Ctrl T to resize it. So I'll bring this down to this part. Bring this down also. Bring this down. Sorry. So I'll bring this here. Yeah. So I can now increase the opacity to like so. You're wondering what's inside that stuff that is changing the color. I'll show you. Don't worry. So this is the two stuff that are inside a color of a solid color and the gradient fee, which has the gradient overlay. So if you need that, you can check out all my tutorials. I have the files there. I use them in so many of my designs that I left the PSD there. So you can just check and get it. So there's no cause for trying to so what else can we put? Let's see. So I want to add my what they call it confetti, which I love adding to most of my designs. So I'll just add it and bring it down here. Then I'll see the size that it is. Then I'll reduce this to something like this. This is long, way too long for me. So I'll do the same for this part. So it's getting skew so I'll just leave it this way probably so I'll just reduce the opacity again like 50 is okay so I'll bring my master adjustment drag it here and just place so these are many more things I want to make design stands out at the end. So 
So I need to close these places up. So if you want to see what's there also, these are what's there. So I can add this more, more of this. Yeah. It's like 12. The vibrance is there. The level is, is okay. So I'll just leave that there then. Finally, what I want to add? There's something missing, there's something missing. I want to add my sparks. Let me see if I if that is really needed. Maybe I'll remove those flowers down and add that to it. I'm just guessing. I'm not saying I will do that. So there you drop. Once it drops, I guess we are rounding up. So my parental adversary, I'm going to remove it from that angle, shift it to the right, and I'll bring my logo to the left and pull my sparks, and I guess we should be done. But before then, there's a secret I want to reveal to you guys at the end of this video, so stay tuned to the end. There's something I'm about to tell you and it's really help you. It's an opportunity and it's going to really go a long way. So I don't know what's wrong with my system. It's just to drag a layer is taking this much time. I don't understand. So let's be patient. Okay, it's there already. So with this now, let me see if I can remove my yeah, I think removing that flower should should be okay. I'll bring this down, bring this more, bring it down. So now, so I need to reduce this size first. To the, okay, let me leave it that way. So, but sincerely speaking, you don't need this for this kind of song. But I just felt, I just want something to, I just want it to be crowded. I want it to be, you know, just do something abnormal. But you don't need this. So, I'll go and pick my logo. My logo is somewhere here. So, I thought I don't have a logo. I don't normally use them. I don't normally use it. I don't know why I don't use it though. So, just pardon me. I, I don't. So, let me see if I remove these two flowers. What will happen? I don't know if it's looking more better now without the flowers or it looks empty. So I don't know which one you feel. Let me know in the comment section with the flower or without the flowers like this. All like this so let me just know in this section so maybe our models are not even showing anymore maybe we need to make them show a little bit we just reduce this opacity a little bit I saw our models our heart is sorry so maybe we'll leave it at 40 and see yeah they are showing a little bit now